I am Jim DiCola, Master Luthier with Gibson USA, here at the Frankfurt Music Mesa, and I'd like to show you some of our new products from Gibson USA. Here we have the EB bass, we have the five string version and the four string. We debuted these uh, initially last year, but we've redesigned them for this year. We've moved the jack to the rim, it's a little more stable, uh, away from the pick guard. We have our tuned coil tap, so it, it taps the pickups, doesn't drop the volume, it's hum reducing, it uh, uh, offers eight truly distinctive sounds in a passive format. It sounds active, but it's really passive, very versatile, swamp ash body, rosewood fingerboard, maple neck, satin finish on the neck, and it's a, a set neck. So it's piano-like sustain, very versatile bass, very lightweight and uh, versatile sounding. From the, the EB series, we have our classic T-Bird basses, pretty much historically correct that we've done it for many years, as our SG basses are. And then uh, lastly, uh, new in the bass line, we have the Midtown Signature Bass. The Midtown Signature Bass is a 34-inch scale length bass, rosewood fingerboard, maple neck, mahogany back that's chambered with a maple top. So it, it has our classic uh, SG pickups and uh, master volume, master tone, three-way pickup selector switch, and three-point bridge. Classic appointments with a, a new um, chambered body that gives it a more resonant and airy sound. It's based, uh, the body shape is based off of the 70's Les Paul signature model. So it's a, a new bass based on an old historical model. Here in our guitar line we have the Jeff Skunk Baxter signature model Firebird. It's based off of the Firebird 7 from years past. Jeff added some new twists. He, he actually modified one of the guitars himself and then presented it to us and then we developed the signature model with him. Each pickup is activated by its own rocker switch. So you can get any combination of pickups, uh, each individual or all three together, and each pickup also has its own coil split switch. It has a master volume, a master tone, and the lyre tailpiece vibrato. It's a very versatile guitar. As many of you know, Jeff has an extensive recording history and plenty of session work, uh, Steely Dan, Doobie Brothers, so he wanted a really versatile instrument uh, and still classic at the same time. The mini humbuckers have been redesigned, so they're a higher output, uh, not a distortion class, but higher output uh, mini humbucker, about the same output level as a, a PAF class humbucker, and then when they're coil split, they have a classic chimey mini humbucking tone. Next we have the SG Futura series guitars. This is a, a all new series for this year. It features the new Sidewinder P90H pickup in the neck position. That is a hum canceling P90 based off of technology that Seth Lover done uh, in the early 60s. So there's two coils instead of facing in this direction like a conventional humbucker, they're rotated 90 degrees so the magnets are facing inward at the screws and that creates a center point hum canceling pickup so it's, it's hum canceling yet it has a single point under the string so it's a brighter sound and a more convincing P90 voice so we're very proud of that it's also coil splittable as is the burst bucker pickup in the bridge position so there's push pull pots to activate that we also have a 15 dB adjustable clean boost activated by the toggle pot. It's also internally adjustable so you can adjust the gain level from zero or from unity to 15 dB or any point in between. Runs off a 9 volt battery and, and uh, also not only for lead boost but for tone shaping. It's a very versatile system. Next up we have the Les Paul Melody Maker. This is based off of the historical Melody Maker which has generally been our most affordable model in the product line. For this year we've offered a contoured maple top just like the Les Paul, same top contouring and uh, mahogany back. So it's made out of the same materials as the Big Brother Les Paul has a maple neck, rosewood fingerboard, and two P90S pickups. So these pickups are based off of P90 style pickups Gibson did in 1946 for the first time, featuring Alnico magnet slugs. So it's a brighter, more percussive voice. They're uh, calibrated, so they have balanced output in the bridge and neck positions, as well as being hum canceling in the center position. Has a wraparound bridge, so it's rock solid 
two volumes, two tones, like a classic Les Paul with a three-way pickup selector switch. So it's uh, our most affordable model, but it's still classic, quality Gibson construction made entirely in the USA. Here we have the Les Paul Signature and Classic models. They're very similar in a lot of respects. Primarily the, the electronic assemblies on both are the same. So we have the, the 15 dB Pure Boost activated by the mini toggle switch. We have coil splits for each of the pickups and a master tone. Pickup selector switch and then on the Les Paul Signature we have dual open face 57 classic humbucking pickups. We have Les Paul signature embossed on the pit guard as well as 99 signifying how old Les would be if he was with us today. We have black and white multiply binding, double uh, A figured maple top, rosewood fingerboard, mahogany back and neck. On the Les Paul classic, again same control assembly but we have a super 57 zebra pickup in the bridge and then a zebra 57 classic in the neck position again coil splittable maple top traditional weight relieving mahogany back mahogany neck and rosewood fingerboard here we have the les paul futura series again uh, this the futura series on the les paul shares many of the features as the sg model so we have the p90h sidewinder hum canceling pickup in the neck position the burst bucker three in the bridge position and now what's different on this model is we have push push pots so the push push pots on the volume controls coil split the respective pickups and then the 15 db boost is push pull or push push pot on the neck tone control so it's very quick very ergonomic yet still retains the classic historic les paul look maple top mahogany back modern weight relieving and rosewood fingerboard it also features the mini tune autom automated tuning system Here we have the Les Paul Supreme. The Les Paul Supreme has been uh, extensively redesigned for this year. Most notably, uh, the, the Supreme has always been fully chambered, but this year most notably we have bound F-holes. The bound F-holes just give it a, a more classic jazzy appearance, and along with that we have the mini humbucking pickup in the neck position. Based off of the classic floating jazz pickup we've used in the past, but we've added Alnico 5 magnets to better balance it with the, the PAF burst bucker 1 in the bridge position. 24 karat gold hardware, genuine ebony fingerboard, genuine mother of pearl crown inlays, the 120th anniversary banner inlay at the 12th fret signifying our 120th anniversary, new mother of pearl supreme logo, and gold truss rod cover. It's the top of the line of the Gibson USA product. The Les Paul Standard line now has three tiers, starting with the Les Paul Standard, which features the Mini Tune system. Moving up, we have the Les Paul Standard Plus, and the Standard Plus has a 4A maple top, so it's a, a one grade higher than our regular standard. From the Les Paul Standard Plus, we move up to the Les Paul Premium Top. The Les Paul Premium Top features a quilted maple top, and that would be the top tier of the Les Paul Standard model line. They all share the same electronics with the four push-pull pods for coil taps, phase, and pure bypass. Burst Bucker Pro pickups, locking Tone Pro bridge and tunematic, as well as locking Grover tuners. Next we have the Les Paul Peace Series. The Les Paul Peace Series is a tribute to the summer of love and, and the whole hippie era. So we have many appointments as uh, the, the tie-dyed silk screen logo on the knobs, the peace sign, the, the peace uh, laser engraving on the stop tailpiece, and another fine detail on the stop tailpiece tuning adjustment screws. If you look closely, you can see a little peace emblem on there. So that's, you know, nice cool appointments, you know, dedicated to the summer of love. We also have a tie-dyed motif uh, toggle switch cap. We have cute um, 
kind of hippie names for the colors. We have Placid Purple, Serenity Sunrise, Mellow Out Green, all kind of mellow 60s vibe colors. Very new colors too, very fresh. And uh, the guitar is also available with a hemp covered case with uh, peace sign graphics. And there we have the, the latest from Gibson USA.